Hello? We're back for the messenger. Whew. This game's been fun. Actually, gonna try and play... Not today, but... Gonna try and play... A few more in a row. Oh, that's right. We ended up here! And try and get through the game. Because there is way more content in this game than I thought. Ooh. Ooh! I'm curious. Oh, this is this area. Oh my god, are there areas above me? So here is this. Still haven't found that. This. This. So there's only one more area that I haven't found. And nope. Yep. Nope. Yep. There's a bunch of stuff in here. World map. Nope. Okay, so there's a note in here. That prophecy makes it pretty obvious. How do I get... I wonder how I get to... Here? Where the little... Little man might be. You know what I'm talking about, right? The little man. The last, uh... Last one of these guys. The Phobikins. Yeah. Because that's the way to get back to the temple. Oh boy. What's in here? Okay. There's a lot to do. <laughs> also, I haven't seen any enemies. Oh. Looks like I need a sun and a moon crystal. Which is very quickly giving me... Sea of Stars energy, which makes sense. I can't get up there, but I can get up the other way. I can also go down. It's fun. Wait, there's actually... Oh, I see. Okay. Oh, my goodness. What the hell? Is this... Possible? I feel like... No, that doesn't... Looks like it changed anything. I don't understand. I can't do this, right? Huh? Okay, I think I need something else. If I had to guess. Wait, no, I need to go over here. Yeah, I think I need something else that's in here. Because I don't think that way was going to be it. Let's try this way. This way seems, ow, slightly more reasonable. These enemies don't seem reasonable, though. Uh, okay, finally hit one. What?! Well, that was just rude. <laughs> that is not the longest cycle in the world. Oh, can't go there either. Oh boy. I mean, it makes sense. This is a late game level, but... I think I have it out for me. Aha! Okay, this is what I thought was going to happen. Like, I thought... No, oh, I just have to fly through this, I think. I'm sure there's a different way to do that, but I can't be bothered figuring it out. Oh, goodness. Oh, that's bad. Okay, that's not so bad, actually. I thought that was going to be way worse. So I think it has to be the future for me to get through a bunch of these... Uh hazards, which is what I thought was going to be the case. Uh, nailed it. Every area fills me with concern. Okay, this has to be this in order to do anything. I don't know what I thought was going to happen, but exactly what you would expect to happen in that scenario happened. Nice. Thought of that 
just at the last second there. And I have to do this. That is very frustrating. There's a lot of level to backtrack through. Oh, I see. Oops. There's a little, uh, there's a little divot you can hide in. This level, man. Okay. What? Okay, whatever. I don't know why that didn't. Oh, interesting. This thing broke apart again. Gave me health, which was good. Back to this section. That gave me health, which is good. Ow. Probably could have dodged it if we're playing at home. I keep forgetting which button the dash button is, and it's irritating. I guess I have to wait because the water pushes you in. Oh my god, why is that so fast? Ow. This is healthier. That seems very intentional. This thing is unbelievably fast. Okay, we're getting into the hang of everything. I feel like that's kind of the case with this game generally. You forget everything you know and then all of a sudden it comes back. Start to get to the groove again. Oh, cool. So there's a power seal in the next room. This is just a save point. Nothing special. Power seal over here? No, above me. Uh... Fine. And I guess, oh yeah, once I change the time, it will be above me. Yeah. Uh, that's actually very slow. All right, here's the first seal. Uh, Ow. Oh, that's really bad. Okay. So you can't get past that at all. This room is oddly very easy. I don't really know why I'm doing all this, but whatever. Because I can. This room is almost too easy. But honestly, I'll take it. There's enough shenanigans in this game. Do I have to jump on this? Oh, that's not so bad. And then this, perfect. Okay, that was really not that bad. But yeah, those things basically insta-kill you. Do I have to change the timeline? I guess I don't have to. I'm kind of curious what it's like with it, without it. Oh, looks like... Oh, no, actually. Looks like I can get over this way, potentially. This looks unfun. Oh, please. The ascent is very slow at times. Waiting for my sword to recharge. Ah, uh, I don't like that enemy at all. That enemy is no fun. All right, cool. Now what? Oh, it looks like I have to go in here. Oh, that's fun. Wait, it's going to come back, right? Yeah. I was like, uh, I don't want that. Oh, that is an absolute. That is a very troll enemy spawn. Oh, the enemy spawn is maddening, actually. Speaking of. Oh! Oh, please. Oh, there's a save. Ooh! What are these? Ooh. 
Yes. Now I can walk over spikes. <gasps> RT. Like this. Wrong trigger. This trigger. Oh, that is cool. Okay. So I was correct. I did need an item in order to get past some of these sections. Oh, that feels delicate. Now I'm back here. Nice. Okay. And I did a whole loop to figure out the bot, the base. Now I'm going to do this. It's a cool dungeon. Oh, that's so cool. All right, there's a power seal this way too. This is actually the main reason I'm going this way. For seals. Uh, oh, interesting. Nice. Can I run over the spikes? I don't think so, right? I don't know where I'm going. Kind of want to go this way. This is just a time change though, right? The fact that that enemy can snipe me is very annoying. Wait, does that go somewhere? Goes, well, I want to go this way first. I'm just going to go this way. But I guess I could make it uh, a couple of it hit me. Oh, interesting. Looks like I do need to go this way. In order to... Looks like I need to go this way in order to... Uh, what am I trying to say? In order to get out. Nice. Okay. Yep. Uh, it's fine. Uh, it's not fine. Ow. Or save there. I think I have to do that again. Yikes. Oh, I'm back here. That's very unfun. Uh, whoops. It bumped me back up, which is pretty funny. No health? Please? Yikes. Ow. There's one there. But it's kind of far. Man, there's so much cool stuff in this game. Oh no. Oh no. Ow. Should eventually find everything I need. Man, this is such a long slog to have to go back through. Wait, there's a thing there? Did I just blatantly ignore that? I think I did. Okay, well I have only myself to blame, as always. I'll just wait for the cycle. I think the thing I've realized that is very helpful is that if you go exactly... Oh, wait. That's bad. This enemy is the worst. Okay, that was not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Nice. I'm going to health drop. Uh, what I was going to say is the nice thing I can't even think right now I'm trying to pass this screen the nice thing is that no I actually don't remember what I was gonna say I had I had a good point and then I just completely got lost in how ludicrous this screen looks oh there's a thing over there how do I get there I, I have to go a different way I'm gonna wait Okay. Oh, I remember what it was. It's about swimming. The nice thing about this game is that... Wait, what? Wait, huh? Hang on. Oh, I see. I think. This is irritating. This is really irritating, actually. 
I would like to not die. The nice thing about this game is that when you hit the swim button, it is just a straight line that stays. Where do I go? I don't think it's possible. Yeah, I think I have to do this. Hit this again. It's kind of fun. Uh, yeah, it's nice that for swimming through the spike sections. Ow. Oh my god, that's embarrassing. Please don't die. At least I actually have a decent amount of health. Uh, yeah, when you swim, again, it's taken like two minutes to get this point out. When you swim, you stay in a straight line, which is nice when you're trying to avoid spikes that are underwater. Oh, nice. Also very necessary to avoid the underwater spikes. Oh, I think I have to go back. I don't want to get that seal. All right, I am going to go do that. Oh, can I not go back right now? Oh, no, I can. Nice. Yeah, I think I need it to be... I think what I'm trying to do makes sense. I hope so. So, yeah, I think I can demonstrate. So right now... Oh! Oh! <laughs> Okay, I'm at the bottom. That's nice. Uh, I think right now... Looks like a... Uh, I think right now it's closed, but if I shift it into the other timeline, it'll be open. I think I'm just going to say that's true and do it. I'm pretty sure it is. Okay. Wait, no, it's the other way around. Crud. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Unless, no, surely this is the way to get there. Wait, no? It's locked the whole time? Let me in! Okay, I guess I have to go left at the bottom of that screen then. I don't know how to do that. But we'll see if we can figure it out. I literally can't traverse this section without going... Oh my goodness. Please die. I can't traverse that section without it. Can't run this way. <gasps> Never mind, I can run this way. Oh wait. Oh, I almost ran it down and I remembered I had the light foot tabby. I actually was so close to just completely throwing it away. I do not like these enemies. I'm just gonna race them. Uh, never mind. I have a platform I can safely kill them from. I'm doing this very carefully. Oh, there's a seal there! Woo! That's cool. Okay, so the whole room was the seal room. Nice. All right, now we gotta go right. Whew, this is spicy meatball. Also, being dropped here is just like very troll. Uh, no, this is correct, I think. So is that just not there? Or did I just have to like figure that out? I think maybe that's actually available in both timelines, but I don't know. Anyway, we did it. Maybe not because the Water has to be moving, I think, but interesting idea. Kind of fun. Okay. Yeah, last one's down there. There's a decent amount of this level to explore, Stu. And we do need the key items to unlock that door, which I assume has the note in it, but they made it pretty obvious that, like, I'm going to need to get in there. And I'm pretty sure it's a sun sig sigil and a moon sigil because I can pay attention to visual cues. Ow. Not particularly challenging, I might add, but I am paying attention. Contrary to popular belief. Ooh, that was kind of spicy. Whoa! That was a lot of stuff that just happened. This game really likes to surprise you, you know? 
Never know what you're gonna see on the next screen. Oh, this is just one of these. This is fine. Much easier now with the light foot. Oh, I stopped moving. Okay, yeah, if you reverse it also doesn't work. Is this open now? Okay, that's nice. I was like, I don't wanna run through that again. <laughs> again, I don't really need the currency, but I'll take it. Nice. I don't need to go the other way, right? I don't think so. There's also a save point here, which is... Oh, there's the thing. Nice. Go. See? Visual cues. Sun and moon crest. Is there a boss? There might be a boss. That'd be kind of fun. I haven't had a boss fight in a minute. Uh, I do want to go down, I guess. Oh. That wasn't that exciting. Good to know about, but... Don't exactly need it. Uh, where am I? Oh, <laughs> that was fun. I thought I could break that block, but it's not true. I guess I'll put the thing in. And I guess, yeah, this is, now we do the reverse. So this should lead to the last seal. There's only three seals here, right? Yes. And should lead to the last crest. Hop and off. All right, let's do it. I guess maybe we can only open the door. Ow. I guess these enemies are just always here to be annoying. This is a really cool dungeon, by the way. I think I've had some, not bad, but like, I've definitely been like a little meh on some of the dungeon design. That was a fun little damage boost. Very unintentional, but it worked. Uh, there's a lot of, but this dungeon is really well designed. Like, the flow is very sensible. Not a particularly complicated, ah, oh, crap. I have to time this properly. Again, life with Tabby learning. All right, not too hard. Please don't hit me. Oh my God, that would have made me so angry. Uh, it's fine. Nice. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Oh my god. We're so back. It's so over. That was that whole... That whole song and dance in two seconds. Ow. Don't. Not like this. I'm gonna kill you for fun. Okay. Where's the next save point? <laughs> oh. I don't like that. Health? I'm just gonna take this very slowly. Excuse me? Bruh. I'm getting scammed. I'm telling you, that was an absolute scam. Somebody called Kitburger. I've just been scammed. <laughs> Holy moly. <laughs> oh, that was so annoying. <laughs> Even, so again, talking about the design of this dungeon, how much I like it. Even, like, little things that are annoying, but clever. Oh, not that. That's not annoying and clever. That's just me being bad. Um, like, here. I'll actually demonstrate it because I died. Um, kind of just want to take the damage boost there always, to be honest. Nice, health drop. I don't know how guaranteed the health drops are. They seem pretty consistent. But, so, the enemy that just died there. The Spear Fisherman. This enemy respawning is like, kind of whatever. Ah, uh, fudge. Uh, I need to do this properly. Sorry, I'll explain and then I'll do the timing thing. Because I'm clearly not capable of doing both. And that's okay. It's good to understand your weaknesses. That was bad. Oh. Should hold up. Like, I might be able to swim over... Oh. <laughs> I might be able to jump, sorry, over that first bit of spikes, but it doesn't feel worth it. Hold up. Nope, holding up also didn't work. Oh. Some of the swimming physics are hurting my brain. Oh, okay, never mind. It's, once again, it's a skill issue. Remember when I said, like, 
five to ten minutes ago that one of the nice things about swimming was that uh, you were always in a straight line. Like a fixed distance? Yeah. Turns out that's helpful. <laughs> anyway, so the enemy that just died is going to respawn and throw spears at me after I get out the other end of this little section. Which is annoying, but is, I would say, relatively good design. Ooh, thought I was going to miss the window. Yeah, see? That guy back over on the left? Really annoying. But a clever piece of design. Uh, it's fine. It's not fine, actually. Oh, that is... He's dead, which is good. Oh, extra good, actually. Uh, should focus. <laughs> okay. Just trying to, like, slow it down. These spear-throwing enemies are so irritating, though. Alright. I think this is the furthest we've been. Nope, that was a lie. We got here last time. Kill those two. Don't want to deal with that. Getting in the water. I mean, seems fine. Seems not very hard. Which I kind of don't want to say out loud, even though I just did. Because I feel like it's going to get really unfun in just a moment. Oh, stars do not go through walls. I do not have a sword. Alright. Uh, that was just me being bad. Oop. Oh! That's actually tragic. I didn't hit a save, did I? Oof. It's okay. So, again, lessons we're learning. As soon as you start spinning, your position is fixed horizontally, which is actually very handy. I almost hit the... I almost hit the little time shard capsule thing, which would have been a mistake because it would have used my, ah, uh, would have used my uh, empowered slash up, which one shots those very frustrating little enemies. Uh, that's fine, I guess. Health, please. Unlucky. Oh my god, when they start jumping, it's a bad time. Nice. I think I'm just killing that one out of habit at this point. I think we're good. Oh, this seems way better, actually. Uh, is that actually good? I don't know if it's good. Uh, damn. I, like, let go. Okay, we're good. Ooh, that's fun. Little water boost. Oh, that's a mistake, actually. It's actually kind of a big one. Ah, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, it's kind of a big one, because, like, letting yourself die there. So, was it? Letting yourself. Oh, yeah, hitting the. Hitting the little uh, consumable thing instead of the instead of the other thing that's better. Hitting the consumable thing instead of what am I saying? Again, I'm trying so hard not to die. <laughs> reach. Yeah, it does reach. Oh, wow! Did I just? Instantly stop while swim dashing. That's good. Oh, bless up. Okay. Oh, actual relief. Now I can run down again. Uh, I would like to snipe you. That's a fun little spot. Also feels pretty necessary. Oh, is that where the seal is? Yeah. Oh, this game, man. Never. Oh, that's frustrating. I want you to have fun. Oh! <laughs> okay. 
Oh, interesting. Nice. Oh, so clean. Let's go. And looks tempting to go left, but you can see the little dots on the ground. That means it's a pit. Don't go down it. We have learned our lesson after many, many, many hours of the messenger. No, we must go down this way. That's fun. Okay, nice. So we got all the seals. We just need to finish this last section and get ourselves out to safety. Oh, sometimes the game isn't nice. Wait, what? Oh, interesting. Ha, 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 ha. Ha, ha, ha. Oh, well, gee whiz. Wonder what's gonna happen here. All right, now where do I go? Up. Ooh. Fun. I was really thought that thing was gonna hit me. Uh oh, oh, holy sh! I'm him. I'm actually him. I actually might have to go the other way. Uh, I don't like that things are shooting me. Although, might be helpful for getting up. Ow. Do I actually have to do it this way? I don't think so, but... I needed that thing to die. Maybe that thing would help me, actually. That, that's not okay. I got the seal, right? Yes. Okay. Good enough. I guess the, oh, I don't remember actually. Uh, oh, <laughs> no. Almost happened again. I wonder if these are set spawns. Like they're always, the first two will always hit the, Okay, well, I literally can't go up, so I have to go down. I know, such sage advice. Now we swim. Okay. I'm just going to ignore the other things. Uh, these are very annoying. How am I supposed to kill that one? Okay. I think they're gone. I hope. Didn't have to go the other way. These things want me dead. Uh, it's fine. Nice. Nice. Oh, that's it. Let's go. All right, is there a boss? I don't know if I can handle a boss right now. But you know what? For the sake of completion. Oh, I see. Again, really clever. Like, make sure both exits lead up here. Both exits. Go back into the future where the door is. Like, just some really very thoughtful level design. Love to see it. All right, I'm gonna hit these two things on my left and right, and then I'm gonna go in here. And I'm 99% sure there's a boss fight. But we're just gonna say, okay. I don't really wanna do a boss fight right now, but it is what it is. Oh, maybe there's no boss fight. What do I get now? I am weary. Oh, sanctity. I love some sanctity.
Oh. That's... That's the, the Guardians, right? From Sea of Stars. That's so cool. Man, I'm literally going to have to watch a YouTube video or something to connect these two games, but I feel like I'm finally getting a little bit of it. That's so cool, though. Ooh, see? The stars. Nice. I'm popping off. Oh, wait, do I get even further beyond? Oh, it's just a note. Whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What else do I need? Uh-oh. Oh, the door's just closing. I thought we were going down. All right. Well, that's going to be it for this episode of The Messenger. What a sweet dungeon. Really, really cool. We got all the things we need. We progressed the story. We got our note. We got our power seals. And we didn't die that many times. And that is called growth. Thanks so much for watching. It's been a pleasure as always. And uh, yeah, if you want to like, comment, subscribe, feel free to. Otherwise, just thanks for hanging out. I'll see you next time.